Today we're going to take a look at Thriftcart's hourly sales report. So when you open up this report, you'll get the option to select your store location. So I'm just going to choose the shop on Atlantic. And then you can set a date range. I'm going to set a longer date range here. I'm going to go ahead and do March through July. And then when you run this report, it's going to give you a nice visual breakdown of your sales by hour. So you can see in this first section here, you're going to get each hour that sales were run. And it's going to tell you the total dollar amount of sales, the average sales for this hour over whatever time frame. So in this case, 153 days. And then it's going to show you a bar graph just to give you a visual representation of which hour you sold the most. And then it's going to tell you also over here on the right, it's going to tell you your total ticket count. So how many transactions there were in each hour, the average transaction count over that time range, and then the transaction count bar as well. So this will give you a good idea of what your busiest hour of the day is, so you can know how to staff your store and you can know what to expect from your customers as well. Going down to the next section here, we also have a breakdown of day of the week. So we can see over this time frame each day of the week where sales were rung up. And we can see the total sales for each day. So from Monday, we can see the average sales from this day over this date range. And then also a bar graph, total transaction count, average transaction count, and then a bar graph for that as well. So this will give you a good idea of what your busiest day of the week is. So in this case, it looks like Friday is our busiest day here. Not by much compared to Monday, but Friday is a bit busier. So we can expect that we might need more staffing or just expect to have more customers in the store making purchases on a Friday. And then finally, this page will also list out all of the days from the date range you've selected and show you each day's total sales and total ticket count and then bar graphs for each. If you have any further questions about the hourly sales report, please reach out.